All right, lots of exciting stuff today. We're gonna walk the frozen tundra. We're gonna see trusses get set. We're gonna explore a cool rustic ranch. We're gonna go visit Kevin the Home Flipper. All kinds of cool stuff, so let's head on out. All right, so last time we were at the house, they didn't even have any walls up yet. These guys are really quick. They got walls up and they're setting trusses today, so let's, uh, let's go check it out and see what the guys got to say. So I was saying last time I was out here, it was exactly a week ago, you guys didn't have any walls up and now we were just working on the bases. Set trusses. Yes yeah. sir, and had a holiday and cold right, weather Right, that's in there. true, Christmas is in there again. So yeah, we've had a little little slowdown. Yeah, well not much, I was surprised you guys were... Uh... Yeah, we're some of the only foolish ones that are working in this weather. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's I, I noticed the guy across the street ain't working. No, I know, I know. Well, what point, what point do you get to where you're... Divine. Ten, ten, ten below. Divine. Ten below. Okay. The windshield, when it hits ten below, okay, the stuff don't work. Okay. Right. The guys don't work and the machines don't work. Gotcha. But that's kind of the where I draw the Those line. Those are the only the I've only just reasons. learned from experience. So we right. can work when it's zero wind chill or five yeah. below, but when it hits ten below, it just don't seem like the equipment. We spend more time trying to keep stuff going. Right. We keep like extra stuff in there, so when this okay. stuff freezes, we go in there. Yeah, that's a good idea. A little heater. Oh, yeah, it's, it's there warm in there like summer in there. <laughs> There's hoses and guns and yeah. everything else in there, so batteries. Very cool. All right, well, we got a few more job sites to hit, so we'll yes, see you sir. later, Rick. Nice. All right, so the last time we were out at this property, this is the Lambert residence. We're going to be building a custom Livingston model here. The foundation was poured and it needed to be backfilled. So you can kind of see behind me, they got the stone driveway put in there and they've backfilled the foundation. So next step is for lumber to get dropped and the framers are gonna come out here and start. All right, so we are out here at the buyer residence. This is a custom Alexis model. It, uh, it's about 22, 2300 square foot ranch. And this is one of our more popular floor plans that we've uh, that we've built in the past. Right down the road from my house, they're delivering cabinets today, so let's go inside and take a look. Okay, so cabinets are uh, are getting delivered. Paint is on the walls. So next step is the uh, trim carpenter is going to take get all the cabinets installed. We'll get countertops measured for doors. We'll start to get set trim around the windows and uh, things will progress from there. Somebody's here working, let's go see who it is. Kyle. Do it. Yeah, how's it going guys? How's it going? Good. Got the tile going? We're trying. All yeah. right. Mortar bed? What? Mortar bed? Yeah. All right, so first first step of the progress, or first step of the, uh, the tile shower would be the mortar bed. Got to make sure everything's pitched towards the drain. Probably the most important part. That's right. <laughs> That's good. Very good. Very good. Well, are we doing a documentary here? Ah, uh, kind of. It's a little. So I'm Jason from Joseph Scott Homes. Oh. I do all of our sales and everything. Oh, okay. And so this is going to be kind of a sales tool. We're going to just go around, check out all the houses that are in progress, and okay. you know, people can kind of see things and get to know us before they come in and, and build. So okay. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Sounds so. Good. Very good. Well, we'll see you guys later. Right. Have a happy new year. Yeah, you too. All right, so we're back at uh, Kevin's Flip House. Everything's gutted in here. It's looking cleaner up here. Hey, I want to. Uh, I want to thank you guys. Caution, wild animal. I like that. Yeah, I want to thank you guys for all the Christmas present you sent me and my employees. <laughs> Nothing. But anyway, uh, yeah, I'm like, did we actually let's just get make something? him money. Um, no, that's right. I can uh, kill a couple of squirrels tonight. Uh, no, so we're getting uh, farther here now. So, 
We got the walls all opened up, got okay. all the electrical all put in, got rid of all the bad wiring, <coughs> uh, got our plumbing moved. Oh yeah? Uh, yeah. We had to cock up all the holes going in because that's code. So this is waiting for permits. Okay. And we're going to close all this. So they got to come and inspect it? Yep. It's coming. Uh, it does make it look a lot cleaner. And so Kevin drywalled all the, all the walls. It does look nice because, I mean, otherwise you got the... And we're putting insulation behind it. The black, so... so it would be nice. Yeah, because I just think if somebody pulled it, doesn't it just look old? Yeah. Yeah, and that or the orange colored wood against the black. Yeah, um, I just think yeah. for the couple hundred dollars in your time, I, I think you have to. Yeah, yeah. Just because if you're going to try to get, you know, a decent dollar for it, it's got to be clean. Yeah. I cleaned it out for all the presents I was going to get from Joseph Scott. <laughs> just didn't show up. Yeah. Sorry, Kevin. No, it's all right. Well, we, we completely forgot. I know. It's a nice place to live if you're a snowman. <laughs> <laughs> so, now we decided to move that. Because the kitchen table is going to go over here. Right. But then Jason, being the nice guy that he is, told me that, well, you're right in the walkway. So, so, so I made it. Three I admit it. You were right. right. <laughs> so we're just going to go with the can lighting up here. Okay. Yeah, that'll look cool because then this whole ceiling, I mean, you'll have, I always like the look of right. this light. So then we're going to get the wood, room. fill those in. Remember, we took that. That little side wall out. Yep, so the wall got dropped back. So we opened this up, so that's going to be all ready for our, what do they call those? Cabinets? Cabinets. <laughs> and what do they call the, the bigger ones? The oh, the pantry cabinets. Pantries. Yeah. The two pantries. Yep. So that's all open. I got that. that? Oh, oh, nice, Kevin. All right. You know, I like the glitz. Do you know how inexpensive that was? So the whole... Yeah. Well, I can even see what I'm showering just in step here. On my tub like and it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> no, no, just go ahead, Jason. Soft shoes. Um, yeah. So what I did is uh, I got this tile. This I thought this was a good accent. But yeah. It did that again. I'm colorblind. So I hope you like that. Because I thought that was a good accent. What color do you think this was? Uh, see, to me, this is gray. Oh yeah. No, I I, I could see uh, grayish. Great. Can you? Yeah. And then what's in here? Chrome. But there's, Mirror. there's some browns in there, right? Because we're going to paint it that color that you told me? Yep. We're gonna get yeah, there's browns in there, a little black. I like it. I, it's, it's a nice... So, know, yeah. So the mirror. drop down was taken out. So we gained a foot and a half. Yeah. That's, that'll showcase. This, so this that'll is, look really nice when people come in here and see that. Yeah. Okay. I wish yep. we had a little bit of room to do the double sinks. <clears throat> One of my favorite words, the schluter. This is a Schluter strip. Why do you call that Schluter? That's what it's called. Sounds like a disease when you want to What do you do? <laughs> Dr. Mr. Olowski, you got Schluter. <laughs> it so, does. I agree. So this is all ready to be closed up. So this will be a half bath. You come in from the outside. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Vanity, toilet. Yeah, getting the height in here definitely makes it... Makes it feel a little bit better. How did that keep going there? Hey, kids, you can put the Christmas tree away. There's no presents coming from Joseph Scott. <laughs> Poor kids. <laughs> so, okay. <laughs> Say I can't be a plumber, look at my moves. During construction, my employees can go to the bathroom anywhere they need to. <laughs> See? It's better than a port of That's all you gotta do. Heat it in here. Yeah, just come out here, clean it out every couple And you actually got a nice view. You can watch people walking by. Now they can watch you. Yeah. Was there a cop here? I can get this closed up. So. All right. Yeah, the cabinets will be here in about two weeks. And then by then, all everything should be done. Tomorrow, the electrician will be here. He's gonna get all the electrical put in. And then. We uh, insulated all up in here. Because nice. if you're from Wisconsin, you have to insulate up in here. Otherwise, you'll probably lose how much? This is where you lose most of you. This is the biggest area of heat loss in a house. Right. Is in between top of base and wall. And now, you house. guys blow what in yours? Uh, spray foam. Spray foam. Yep. So, but this is, I mean, this is, you know, because you already got a little bit behind there anyways. So you're. I'm gonna call for my inspection down here, and then we can start spraying the ceiling black and get it all closed up. Now, back here. We'll paint the floor, and then I'm going to put um, cabinets up along the walls, and then uh, give her a nice countertop so she can do her laundry. And the rest, we're just going to paint the walls, 
And so you uh, you say she. She can do her laundry. I don't know if our female viewers are going to like that you just automatically assume. Well, that see, the way I got out of it is I did the laundry one time. And my wife goes, you're never doing the laundry again. I go, why? She goes, you mix all the colors. I go, what's the difference? <laughs> Kevin doesn't do the laundry anymore. See, guys, That's you, you just got to do it once. <laughs> just what? Yeah, and you got yeah, to gotta hold the straightest face. Right. What you do you mean? Well, you don't know, mix the colors. I thought Ty brightens all the colors. You know. <laughs> and then uh, Jason tried to save me some money. He's doing my electrical for me. <laughs> you see what a great job he's. We eat at the same time after the spaghetti's done. <laughs> I'm just kidding. So all our runs are here. So tomorrow the electrician will actually put in the new box. For the price, might as well do it. Yeah. And so then, it'll be a 200 amp or, or yep. just a new 100 amp? No, it'll be 200 okay. amp. And then that will be all set. And then we're going to paint up and then that's it. Well, so next time we come back, well, so we'll come back once. Uh, About two weeks. Two weeks? Okay. And then we two got weeks. cabinets and stuff going in. Well, kind of. Because okay. um, well, you know, be the problem is with the holidays, it's moving slow. Yeah, yeah, I know. Because now I got to wait for the stuff. inspection. Then I can start doing that. Right. Um, but you'll see a lot more done. Cool. All right, all right, buddy. We'll see you there later. You gotta give me a paint coat. Yes, that's right. I will. All right, we're coming up to our. Uh, this is a custom Livingston. Trim carpenters are here. Electricians here. So this one's in the finish. We'll go in and check it out. Ooh, I like the uh, the beam. How's it going, guys? Good. Kevin, how you been? All right. Wow. This is cool. I haven't been in here yet. You haven't yet? Wow. This is this is really cool. Very nice. Some nice rustic looking stone. I like that hood. What kind of wood is that on the hood? Uh, just rustic. Wow. That really gives it a nice rustic look. What are what are the uh, the beams, the posts here in the? It's uh, dug fir that I distressed, torched, and then stained. Really? Yeah. Oh, you are the man. Wow. And I got 120 year old railroad spikes in it. Oh, that's awesome. Wow. That's really cool. That's cool. That turned out awesome. Hold the bench there. Oh, that looks good. It's doors. <laughs> so much better than what we had in our model where he got the uh, where he got the idea from that. It's really cool. So is that just flooring then that's on yeah, there? Yeah, is up there. That's cool color on uh yeah. on that so is that just is that just from like blipper then or you get is that no that else um i did a house like two and a half years ago that had that flooring and i brought it in because they wanted to do just one by six so he's probably going to be moving in pretty soon then huh if i can get the rest of the stuff that i've been waiting on a month and a half <laughs> Oh wow, this is cool. So, wine fridge. Look at the edging on the, uh, it's got like the rock face rough edging here. Got a little bit of filler. Really cool feature stove's gonna go here. Filling up your uh, your pots and pans. Very cool. Yeah. We'll go check out the master. Ice maker. Well, he'll be ready to entertain here. That's oh, for yeah. sure. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Very cool. Speakers up there. And, uh, very good. Oh wow, this is different. working yet but this is really cool this is actually tile so it looks like old painted barn board obviously going for the rustic look in this house um, wow really cool shower awesome it's gonna be hard to see um, unless you got your uh, flash in there. Okay, so this is what's matching on the floor this is kind of like the, the accent wall and then we've got this darker Color tile, it's a walk-in. We got a bench here, recess light, huge rain head. Uh, we've got the Kohler, Kohler DTV system here, so this operates the shower heads. Got body sprays, 
I like this uh, this little nook of uh, shelving here for all your shampoo, soaps. Very, very cool. Very cool, very well done. Right? So one of the cool things about this house, it's got 11 foot ceilings pretty much throughout the main area. So we got a big eight foot tall door here. Uh, this is fiberglass, it'll get stained so it'll look like wood, it'll match the rest of the, the stained doors of the house. So we got, uh, looks like they're getting ready for carpet, so one of the last steps in construction is scraping all of the uh, gravel chunks off the floor, getting everything vacuumed before they put the carpet down. And enjoying a nice cold cold. Yes! And having a warm, oh no that's cold. It's not. Yeah. Alright, right now the front porch has 4x4s four that are basically bracing the roof there. Um, eventually it's going to look like they're big posts, but we don't need a full on big post, so this is going to be right here. So. Paper, too. Throws a little... Yeah, uh, four way. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Trying to tell the owner, I'm like, that's not what they told me. He's like, oh my god, I have it. I <laughs> yeah, have it. I All right, well that's going to do it for this week's episode of The Home Show. Thanks for joining. Come back next week to check out a new episode of fun-filled adventures behind the scenes at Joseph Scott Homes and Real Estate. Thanks for joining. From me and Joseph Scott Homes, have a great rest of the week.